I'm Heidi Hewitt with Autodesk, speaking here with Marian Landry, also with Autodesk. Marian, one of the products included with Autodesk, or with the Autodesk Design Suite is Showcase. Can you tell our viewers a little bit about Showcase and how it's used? Yeah, Showcase is basically a presentation tool. So like you can want to talk, think about it a little bit almost like a PowerPoint, but 3D. And it's all happening in real time. So basically you load your DWG drawing or your Inventor file or your FBX. There's a wide variety of uh, format you can load in Showcase. And then you start visualizing in 3D in a real time environment. So you have different environments that you can apply to. You can create alternate uh, material alternative model alternative, so you can experience this building or this project that you're working on in a real-time environment. So it's quite powerful. You can quick, quickly do quick animation, build a storyboard. So it's basically to present what you're working on in now, real time. How does that differ, though, from using 3ds Max design with all its materials and visualization well, obviously, capabilities? Um, it, we use them separately. Everything that you can do in Showcase, you can do in 3ds Max Design and even more. I mean, uh, 3ds Max Design has a lot more tools to offer to do photorealistic visualization, including adding environment, trees, animated characters, all of this extra stuff you can't do in Showcase. And most of the time you'll use Showcase at the beginning of your project to do very quick uh, visualization. Showcase is also very easy to learn. Step by step, you do one thing and then you know, it, you feel like you're almost an art director in Showcase very quickly. Whereas 3ds Max Design, because there's a lot more tools, might take a little bit longer to learn, but the, what you can do with it and the realism that you can achieve is far greater than Showcase. Okay. So, but with Showcase, somebody that's maybe just an AutoCAD user wants to see some quick visualizations, they can pretty much jump right into that and Definitely, start yes. using it without a big learning curve. Yeah, yeah. Simple. It's, yeah, you feel more like, okay, I can do that. 3ds Max Design is also very easy to learn if you start doing it, and it'll offer you a lot more tools in it. So it's like you kind of pick and choose. Kind of depends on, on yeah. your needs. It depends on your need and depends where you are in the project as well and what you're trying to achieve. So if it's more complete visualization, 3ds Max Design, quick rendering, kind of like quick presentation, showcase. So you have both, which is great. Okay, great. Thank you.